I'll confess that I spent way too many hours looking at this and it appears that you can use the software Direwolf as a way to get packet radio to work across amateur radio without needing anything more than a radio and a computer with a sound card. There's even an article by Rick Osgood titled How to Set Up a Raspberry Pi Packet Radio Node with Zork, although I will mention that it relies on hardware to connect to a radio rather than use Direwolf. There's a few moving parts, but it looks like this is totally doable. There's already Docker containers for both Zork and Direwolf, even a container called Packet Zork, and a multi-user version called MultiZork. So how hard can it be? I jest. As an aside, because I'm a geek and I can, there's a common misconception that a Docker container is equivalent to a virtual machine. For lots of reasons, that's not true. A better way to think of it is as a security wrapper around an untrusted application. Speaking of untrusted, while we're all essentially bipedal lifeforms with a similar set of attributes on a daily basis, we seem to discover more and more reasons to find fault or demonize differences. Contrast this within the global community of radio amateurs, where we have this weird activity that we all seem to share. 